Welcome back, fam. This is Chris with Food for Your Thoughts. Hope you're having a wonderful day. We're back. We're back. Continue our light code series. I really hope you've been taking care of yourself and staying safe and learning more about your life path, soul mission, your purpose, your destiny, and you know your natal chart. You know, leaving no stone unturned. Okay, guys. Because remember, it's all about who's you know journey, your soul's journey, your hero's journey, and I'm here. I'm just another reflection of you in a different time of space, just reminding you of your own greatness because you, you came here to do great things. And, I'm you know, part of my assignment is here, you know, just to give you some, you know, proper expectations, some directions, a little motivation, you know, some encouragement saying that you can do it because you're on the right path because you listen to this presentation at this time. All right. But today it's all about angel number 66 vibration and why you keep seeing this number so if you've been seeing this number 66 popping up in your life okay this this presentation is for you okay but be sure to click that like and subscribe button down below i would greatly appreciate it and also check check the, check out the description area because i have some additional cheat codes for you guys because a lot of people don't like to read but please check the description a lot of the the beef of the info let me let me rephrase the lot the, the bulk of the information for further study will be in the description area <laughs> all right so but again the main thing about here is all about knowledge of self self-discovery right it's always more to know about ourselves and, and why are we here right but again our purpose and mission require learning life lessons and to gain experience and knowledge for our soul's growth right growth requires change doing the same thing over and over again expecting different results man you're gonna drive yourself crazy so if you've been doing the same thing ever since you know you was a teenager and you grad you know or younger and you really haven't been bearing fruit you know you have to change some things okay so there's no perfect time than now start now do it now okay but your thoughts Belief, words, emotion, and action are always going to equal your reality and your results. It's been you the whole time, okay? And today, we continue with this light cold series, right? It's all about 66 vibration. And so far, you know, you've been seeing these numbers pop up in your life. And you. so basically, the universe is trying to get your attention yet. Yeah, angels, your ancestors, it's like a little alarm clock, you know, remind you like, hey, you know, you keep going you're on the right path but you know keep this in check keep that in check or you, you may need to slow down on this these are just messages for you and it's up to you to figure out what these messages really mean but i'm sharing you know my own personal experiences and perspective with you and hoping that you know it will add some some value to your life along your journey which i know it will okay especially when you use these seven hermetic principles you know each and every day and you know in your life especially that cause and effect you would thank me later but again you guys been receiving some supernatural aid that will lead you to this presentation help from all kind of places because the universe knows you want to change and you will see you know people from different places would just pop up in your life to help encourage you guide you give you some valuable information and that's what you know i'm here to do i'm like that coach mentor and you know from eons ago we made a pack like hey i got you covered when we get down here okay so i'm letting you know it's going to be some temptation but again, when you're able to, you know, rise above the plane of all the BS, and that's part of my mission here with these seven hermetic principles, you'll be able to, you know, you skip levels, okay? But it's all about transformation because you, at the end of the day, you still have to do the work, ladies and gentlemen, okay? And it's all about atonement, rebirth, and coming back a new person each and every day, okay? Each and every week, each and every month, each and every year. Because this, this mission, your journey never ends. This is a never ending story, okay? But, and why this is important? Because, you know, when you know the law, the seven hermetic principle, you'll be able to, to notice that, hey, from, you're getting a bird's eye view because the masses of people are, you know, being carried along, obedient to the environment, the wills and desires of others stronger than themselves, heredity, suggestion, and other outward causing, moving them about like pawns on the chessboard of life. But the master, like us, right, because we, we use these seven hermetic principles, right, we dominate our moods, characters, qualities, and powers, as well as our environment surrounding ourselves and become movers instead of pun, the three initiatives, the cabalion. Okay, guys, 
So when you see the reason why you seeing these numbers, the, again, the universe is remind you like, hey, you stand in synchronicity, you know, but keep these things in check. But, you know, the, the plant, the frequency, the kundalini energy is rising all over the planet. And this is affecting the, the macrocosm and the microcosm as above, so below, as within, so without. And so each of each and every one of us, you know, are going through changes. Like like I said, growth requires change. Right. And our individual energy is rising. And we ask more questions. We want to know, like, hey, what am I really here to do? Besides working, going to school, getting a job, and not really having that time to, you know, for my family and my purpose, right? And so we ask for more questions. And so, and, and that's affecting each and every one of us. But when you see this number 66, and, you know, in my experience, guys, it means, you know, balance your physical, material, spiritual lives and give any fears or anxieties about your, your money because I, it, it Nine times out of ten is dealing with money, you know, and material issues. You know, give these concerns over to the angel for heal healing and transmutation. Okay, so we have to transmute these negative energies, these lower vibrations, and really trust as you live your spiritual truth. You know, and as you live your spiritual truth, all your needs will be provided for. Okay, so remember that, you know, as you're on your spiritual mission and, and living your spiritual truth. The universe is going to line things up because, you know, source is with you all the time. Your, your angels, your ancestors, they're with you all the time, okay? It's not like they just disappear, okay? You have a, a special spiritual team that's been assist, assisting you this whole time and led you to this presentation, okay? But listen to them or listen to the message. Pay attention. Look things up. But at the end of the day, stay focused, all right? And it's all about knowledge of self, you know? It's more important. The material items to come and go, but as long as you focus on your spiritual truth and your spiritual journey, learn more about yourself, your life path, your natal chart, things of that nature, and these seven hermetic principles are gonna take you far, okay? But let's let's talk a little bit more about this 66 and I'm gonna get you guys out of here. All right. So when you see in this number 66, what does it really mean? You know, some of the key attributes and characteristics. So the number six, you know, of course, is amplified, but it carries the attributes of humanitarian humanitarianism, community service to others, home, family, domestic, domesticity, social responsibility, grace, gratitude and simplicity. Now, the number six also relates to material issues and provision. Now, this number 66 is really a powerful number of unconditional love, healing, faith and trusting in the divine. OK, now, angel number 66 is a message from your angels to really put your faith and trust in the benevolence of the universe as your daily needs are continually being met. OK, so don't worry, you know, just keep sharing great energy and learning from your mistakes. OK, don't repeat the same mistakes, but the angels are assisting and a guide and supporting you with manifesting your goals, desires and wishes. So keep your thoughts positive when this number appear in your life. OK, so don't fear it because you remember we have this this polarity thing. There's a, you know, a good or not so good side of the number. OK, but be aware there's a midpoint, too. So just be aware of these synchronicities. But as we get out of here, the number six, six also asks you to balance your physical, material and spiritual life. Like I mentioned, you know, folk now really focusing on your spirituality and living a conscientious and purposeful lifestyle will ensure that your material needs are met as you serve your divine life mission. Now, give any fears again or anxieties about your money, material issues to the angel for healing and transmutation and trust that, you know, as you live your spiritual truth all of your needs will be provided for and be open when you see this number be open to receiving help and assistance from your angels the spiritual realm and other people in your life because again source your your angels they know that you need help okay so don't worry investigate the problem okay write things down in my experience okay so as we close, you know, the 66 also suggests that all is really well in regards to your home and family. So at this time, enjoy your relationship and your companionship of those close to you and really give love freely and unconditionally. All right, guys. And as we get out of here again, you know, it's all about balancing your, your physical, material and spiritual lives with this number. And don't worry, you know, everything is going to be provided for. Just focus on your spiritual path. OK, 
Knowledge of self is more important. Learn those seven hermetic principles, okay? But when you see this number six, you know, on the surface level, and check the description too, but it's all about humanitarianism, service, family, responsibility, gr gratitude, relates to any kind of material issues, okay? When you see this number, powerful. It's a powerful number of unconditional love, healing, and really just trust in the divine source, right? Because you came from something right so ain't this number 66 is a message you know from your angels really put the faith and trust in the universe and the angel are really assisting with you know manifesting your goals but keep your thoughts positive enjoy relationships and your companionships and give that love freely right have fun fun is a vibration that fear does, doesn't exist but fear will you know to support that fear you know not being in existence in your reality learn these seven hermetic principles and use that cause and effect, you know, be the cause in your own life instead of waiting for effect to happen. Because when you're waiting for effects to happen, that's waiting for luck. Okay, luck. So be the cause in your own life. But this number six, when you, you know, add them up together equals 12. You know, that one and two vibration. One is all about new beginning, fresh starts, right? Two is all about what? Communication. I mean, not communication, but staying balanced relationship, right? And when you're seeing a number going in a sequence like this leading to the three, which it does, because one plus two equals three, you know, you need to take the necessary step. You know, use your talents and gifts as necessary and really trust in the divine, okay? But again, guys, this is all, this is angel number 66 vibration. Our purpose and mission require learning life lessons to gain experience and knowledge for our soul's growth. Growth with Christ change. Share your knowledge and wisdom with people. And remember, your thoughts, beliefs, words, emotions, and actions are always going to equal your reality and your results. This is Chris with Food for Your Thoughts. Be sure to click the like and subscribe button down below. We'll be back with the number 77, okay? But keep learning more about yourself. You got this. You're on the right path, okay? Stay grateful and focused, fam. We'll be back, okay? So this is Chris with Food for Your Thoughts. Until next time, peace.